Hello everyone, this is financial author Ahmed Dan of AhmedDan.com. On this channel, you'll find financial, travel, and more videos just like the one you're watching right now. If you like what you see, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing. Hello everyone, this is financial author Ahmed Dan of AhmedDan.com. Today I'll have another episode of a credit card video and I'll be presenting a Reverse Canada Best Credit Card for 2018. So for, for this video, I'll talk about a little bit from here and then for the next part of the video, I'll take you to my uh, laptop uh, screen where I'll be showing you some other uh, things you need to know. So when you, whenever you're looking at any best credit card rankings or any best credit card li links or any website, uh, keep in mind that these websites are in general, uh, about 99% of the times they're affiliated websites and they are actually actively promoting uh, the credit card companies so for example if you look at the top uh, five credit cards for the best uh, reverse canada 2018 uh, the first credit card is the american express cobalt credit card the second credit card is american express gold uh, credit card and uh, the third uh, credit card is uh, rbc westjet world elite credit card and the fourth credit card is uh, SPG American Express uh, credit card and the fifth credit card is uh, RBC Visa Infinite uh, Avion credit card so all these credit cards uh, do not have any uh, full travel uh, insurance coverages and they do not provide uh, concierge service which is a main thing you should be looking at whenever you're choosing a best credit card except the RBC Visa, uh, RBC, uh, Visa Avion uh, Infinite credit card. So the American Express credit cards, they maybe are good for uh, obtaining points, but they're not a good credit card, or they're not, uh, they shouldn't be best travel credit cards uh, because they're not giving you a lot of valid features. Uh, the main important features, uh, just uh, as I just mentioned, that they do not cover a full uh, travel insurance, and then they do not have concierge services. So these are all actually affiliated links, which I'll show you uh, in a moment, uh, how to detect uh, if any credit card, any websites, uh, uh, they are promoting these credit cards and they're providing you with affiliated links uh, so they can make money uh, based on their ranking. Uh, so the, the more good things they say about the credit cards, the more people will sign up and the more people these sites will make money. So. They are actively promoting uh, these credit card companies and uh, in order to get unbiased and honest opinion, check for those websites which do not provide any affiliated links or which are not affiliated any credit card companies. Uh, this website will not provide you any link uh, and will not uh, give you any even link uh, what it means that they're not collecting money uh, from the credit card companies. And also I have uh, my own so website which is ahmeddan.com and I do credit card reviews. But you will not see any link uh, which will take you to the credit card company's website to sign up for credit cards. And also on my YouTube channel, you will not see any links uh, which uh, provides affiliated uh, links uh, that I can make money off those links. So let me take you to my lap uh, laptop screen and I'm going to be showing you some uh, very important things uh, which will help you to detect uh, how to detect uh, these websites which are promoting uh, the credit card companies and which are providing uh, affiliated links to make money and the best credit card rankings actually is to make more money off you uh, so you have to be careful about what you see there is no really a best credit card it all depends on your lifestyle and what you are looking for however if you are looking for best credit cards in general i would stay away from those cards which do not have full travel insurance coverage and which do not give you uh, concierge services so let's uh, go to my let's uh, go to my laptop screen. Then I'll uh, show you some more information. Thank you. Hello everyone. This is Ahmed Dan. This is the part two of the video. So here I'll show you on my desktop uh, on my laptop screen uh, what you what to look for whenever you're receiving recommendations or top uh, or best credit cards from any website. To find out whether uh, these are honest non-affiliated rankings or uh, these are affiliated rankings and the website has interest uh, to make money uh, by recommending or giving you these rankings so let's take a look at uh, the reverse Canada website so the first thing I'd like to show you are the top 10 uh, the 10th annual uh, travel reverse credit cards for 2018 and if you scroll down then 
you will see uh, these credit cards and as I mentioned before there are the, these are the top five credit cards so now let's click on the link of the first credit card so if you click on the link and what I'll do I'll copy the link so copy link address and then I'll put it on the note to show you uh, how you know that uh, what is uh, that this is uh, a an affiliated website and they're making money uh, by giving you the link so whenever you click the link uh, and sign up for these credit cards and uh, the credit card companies is paying these uh, uh, these websites so I pasted the link and if you take a look at here so if you click that link this is going to take you to the American Express website and here's the affiliated ID so if you look at this ID so this is uh, this ID is how uh, American Express is tracking uh, how many uh, visitors is going to apply or coming going to American Express website through this website and then they get paid so let's take a look at uh, another another website uh, to show you the same thing so here okay I'll copy the RBC uh, WestJet RBC World Elite uh, Mastercard and then uh, let's copy this link copy link address and I'll paste it right underneath our first link okay so here uh, you can see that uh, here's a link here uh, right here and that's how they know that this is an affiliated uh, the person who's signing up for this credit card is coming from this website so that's how they keep track of uh, how many people are signing up and that's how they make money now there's no problem giving you uh, you know affiliated link and making money off you uh, whenever you sign up and giving you the top recommendation to uh, have uh, to mention the best or top travel rewards credit cards there's no problem with that but what is troublesome is that they're not giving you any disclosure or not telling you that these are affiliated links and they're making money so these are not honest and unbiased opinions and also they're not telling you that uh, by signing up for their top recommended credit cards uh, in case something goes wrong let's say you purchase travel uh, with American Express Gold or American Express Cobalt credit card and your trip got uh, cancelled and your loss is three thousand dollars so this uh, websites they, they're not going to pay three thousand uh, dollars due to the losses uh, based on uh, you signed up for their that, that credit card based on their recommendation uh, they're not going to you know stand by you and then and they're not going to tell you that you know they didn't mention that at first and you signed up thinking this is the best credit card but uh, if something uh, goes wrong then you know you need to cancel your trip because this card doesn't provide trip cancellation insurance so you're not going to get back any money and then this credit card or any other or the website Rewards Canada or any other affiliated website which are not giving you the full truth behind any credit cards they're not going to you know pay you back that money so that's 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 the point uh, you know what you're losing so let's say whenever you're getting a best credit card recommendations they should give you all the good things and the bad things not only the good things uh, hiding the bad things so that that's the point where I have problem with these uh, top or best credit card ratings so that's one thing uh, I wanted to show you and then the other thing I'm going to show you the another way you can tell that you know uh, these are this website is promoting uh, credit card companies uh, because they're affiliated is by looking at a press uh, release which was issued by American Express and uh, let me show you that one okay so here is a press release uh, which is let me close my note here so I just closed it okay so Rewards Canada names the American Express Cobalt card as the top overall card for 2018 news provided by American Express so this is a press release issued by American Express uh, you can read the whole thing uh, in order to do that uh, just search for uh, just go to the website link uh, which I'll actually give you right here I'll put it in the note again so if you need to uh, look at the look at this uh, news press release then you can just you know go here so newswire.ca and you can search for American Express or Rewards Canada or you can just copy or you can just uh, 
copy this link actually you cannot copy but if you can just you know do a search uh, for by putting news where American Express yours Canada and you're gonna get a hit uh, so I will just close it uh, so what happens here this is a press release issued by American Express and they're making it a big deal that Reverse Canada chose their credit cards for six categories uh, top spot in three of six categories rankings so here they're you know they're giving you all the details and everything and they're telling you on top of Cobalt American Express cars on multiple awards in the multiple in the following categories so American Express Gold second place the Starwood fourth American Express Gold second place again in another category blue sky another category platinum card is another category and they're even giving you that for more information on the rewards Canada top travel your credit card visit rewardscanada.ca so this is just a cross promotion so rewards Canada is promoting American Express American Express is promoting rewards Canada so that's how it goes uh, uh, so it's just you know these are not honest and unbiased uh, best or top rankings they, these are all just promotional rankings so you're not gonna get any unbiased or honest opinion from uh, these websites so that's what to look for so if you are uh, if you want honest unbiased opinion go for small websites uh, individual websites which are not affiliated with any anyone uh, for example, I can actually show you my own uh, website right here. So let's say if you go to my own website and if you go to a credit card review, uh, so let's go to credit cards reviewers here and I'll just show you one credit card. I have lots of credit card articles, but I'll just show you one of them which I reviewed a credit card. So let's take a look here. Okay, so okay, so here is TD Cashback Visa Infinite Credit Card Review. So let's go to that article, and if you go to the article, then you'll see that I have a disclosure right at the top. Although I didn't have to, but I put disclosure mentioning that this is an honest and non-affiliated review right here so these are not compensated or affiliated with any credit card companies all credit card articles are 100 unbiased and if you go through the whole article you're not going to find any link anywhere so there's no link if i giving you link these links are just my to my youtube uh, videos and to my uh another page on the same website it's not any affiliate link so that's how, what to look for whenever you'd like to find any trusted opinions or reviews on any credit card and I'd like to mention show you something else here let's say if you're going to the the problem with Canadian uh, websites like Rewards Canada and, uh, and other big websites uh, who are reviewing or giving top ratings they never mention or disclose anything that you know they they're affiliated so for example if you saw through the whole website of Rewards Canada you're not going to see anywhere that they are mentioning that these are affiliated links and they're affiliated with the company credit card company they are paid by the credit card company so that's a big problem because you're not getting the truth uh, even if you go to the main page let me just uh, take you to the main page let's let's say we're going to the main page here and same thing you're not going to find anything anywhere that mentioned that you know on this site has lots of affiliated reviews or anything on the contrary if you go to similar sites or big websites or small websites in the US uh, so these websites in the America in the US they're always disclosing the truth they're giving you top best or top 10 trade cards but they're telling you that these are affiliated links and links and they make money off you so you know that you know what to look for so you are getting the truth upfront and you know what to expect and you know it wouldn't be a big problem because they're giving you the truth for example i'll take you to the, the pointsguide.com website which is a big website in the us uh, there are lots of articles and top recommendations for credit cards and stuff so let's take scroll down towards the bottom of the website and i'll show you what i mean so if you go here so you keep going 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 
and let's take a look here okay so right here the credit card offers that appear on the website are from credit are from credit card companies from which the points guy receives compensation this compensation may impact how and where products appear on the site uh, so they're giving you information here and they're disclosing that you know these are all affiliate affiliated links and then if you go to any top cards or any listing or any page which has any credit card then they're mentioning you on that page again so they're giving you actually uh, actually sorry this is taking you to the American Express uh, application that's not what I want to show you I wanted to show you another credit card ref uh, review where they're telling you you know these are affiliated uh, but you can check it by yourself later on so this the points uh, the points guide.com is the website so you can see here here again so each page everywhere you will see that you know they're disclosing everything I'll take you to another big website which is uh, million miles secrets.com so this is another website where uh, they talk about miles and credit cards uh, these are all US credit cards so this is the main page so same here if you scroll down towards the bottom of the website then you're gonna see that uh, there is a disclosure and which is uh, right here so many of the compensation credit cards appear on this site are from credit card issues from which this site receives compensation compensation does not impact the placement of cards so they're again they're giving you full disclosure and you know what to expect and you know that you know there's money exchange going on behind these uh, you know rankings ratings or reviews and here even if you go to any individual uh, credit card review or top listing you'll see the same thing but in Canada we never see that they're never telling you so that's why you have to be careful uh, based on these uh, to follow these recommendations or to listen to these recommendations there's no actually 100% top or best credit card everyone's uh, Unix uh, situation is different so what credit card is number one for me is not going to be number one for you uh, for example if you look at the American Express gold rewards uh, credit card this credit card is very good in order to collect points especially if you're making lots of travel purchases it offers two points for lots of categories however in terms of buying full travel like plane ticket hotel or book vacation this is not a good card because you're losing on full travel insurance coverage also this card does not give you a concierge service which is a very big thing in terms of when you are arranging your book uh, trips or travel and if you have problem in foreign countries concierge can always help another card is the RBC Visa Infinite Avion credit card this credit card may not give you lots of points uh, it's not going to give you like you know, two points for travel purchases however it has full insurance coverage and it gives you concierge service access which is Visa Infinite concierge so no credit cards are uh, same and you know it's very it's almost impossible to give you a recommendation for top 10 or top best credit cards so whenever you're choosing credit cards figure out what you need what you're looking for are you looking for points are you looking for travel insurance are you looking for concierge services and are you looking for everything then make up your mind based on uh, you know reviews or ratings from sites which are non-affiliated and provide honest and unbiased opinions so that's all for now if you like what you see please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing and there will be more credit card uh, videos coming up so I'll see you shortly thank you